Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's a new video. Um, I'm, I'm here, we're gonna get into it. We're gonna get straight into it. You can already see what the title is down below. This is my current non-beauty favorites. There are some skincare items that I just, I cannot, I cannot go without speaking about because Wow, and I know that uh, skincare can be attributed to be another beauty item and you know, I, I get that, but I just feel like beauty in this sense, in on this channel, beauty is anything makeup related and all of that. So I don't have anything um, uh, beauty related, although I do have to say this lip though. <laughs> MAC, Retro Matte Lip, the liquid lipstick and feel so grand. Or feel so good whatever it is wow, wow 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 actually I've got it in my pocket what do you mean but it's a non beauty favor isn't it don't don't be fooled I'm just saying feels so grand oh my goodness what do you even mean I have got all my non beauty favorites in a little basket here and I'm gonna share those with you so if you're keen to watch the video, please do subscribe, join the channel, uh, join the JK fam. I've decided I'm going to call it the JK fam because it was a whole huge shindig hoo-ha, blah, blah, blah. And I'm just, I'm over it at this point. We're going to call it the JK fam. And um, yeah, subscribe, join the family. What do you mean? Why? Why? So the first items are tea. One is tea and one is like leaves. Like Kirby kind of leaves or what have you. If you watch my vlogs, you know exactly which tea I'm going to be whipping out and showing you. But if you don't, uh, <laughs> my favorite tea right now is the Woolies Organic Green Tea. I, honey, listen, listen. I, okay, this tea right here. All right. I absolutely love this tea. I wake up with this tea and I go to bed with this tea. I probably drink maybe five, four cups of these a day. And I definitely make a new tea bag. Like I don't re-add water and whatever to an old tea bag. No, I make a new tea bag because I like it strong. I like it fragrant. I like it just ooh, and I really enjoy it with this and these are infusions of mint leaves and I will take this it comes in a tea bag form and I'll take this and I'll dip it into the tea and both of them so there'll be two tea bags in my cup and one of them has got mint leaves and the other has the organic green tea so this one looks like so so yeah I really really love these two together oh my god Beautiful, amazing, fantastic, love it. And then a little bit of nostalgia here. And this is on the days where I feel like I've had a really long day. I'm either very stressed or very tired or very whatever. And I just need something to sort of just, just remind me of, you know, just, just make me feel bring me back to home growing up high school nostalgia my mother it's really a guilty pleasure and I don't have this every day these are the diddle daddle caramel coated popcorn come on come on if you are South African you know about the diddle daddle popcorns and you probably maybe ate them at school I used to love this and I would share it with my mother and I would share it with my um, friends in the kumbi in the transport on our way to school or from school listen diddle daddles are the one and I absolutely love these <laughs> <laughs> the next thing that I'm absolutely, uh, I, I love it so much, but I can't talk about it much in this video because the next video that I'll be doing, we'll be talking about it and all of that jazz. So I can't get into it on this video, but this is by far my number one favorite book since I started reading. I've gone through about, uh, since June, I've gone through about five or six books and but this is 5.5 out of 5. 
Yo, but Tom Dimu Luna, I love this book. I can't talk about it. I refuse to talk about it because I'm going to talk about it in the next video that I'm going to record. So you might see the same lip because I'm, I'm digging this lip. So I'm keeping this lip. Um, but this book, Hunger by Roxane Gay, all I can say is if you have um, at some point have had body image issues um, or have had um, thoughts on how society views women or men of who are heavier and larger in size or had your family come after you in terms of making comments about your body and all of that get this book that's all i'm saying get this book get it. if you've been following me a lot on my social media you know that before my birthday i went on and on and on and on about airpods because i just kind of felt Marantla, like, why aren't the people in my life buying me AirPods? I mean, I, I, I understand it because I just feel like, why should I be buying myself AirPods? Why? I've got people in my life in Tegele, I got AirPods for my birthday. And can I tell you, I, when I say can I tell you, I remind myself, it's just, a, it's just a little side note. When I say can I tell you, I remind myself of my little sister, Hanya. She loves to say, Kathy, can I tell you? Can I tell you? Can I tell you? I got these for my birthday and I have been using them religious. I, okay, I can't put them on now because they're going to connect to my phone. But I've been, yep, they, they, they're, yep. It, oh, hell, makeup. Okay. Um, I've been using them religiously. I love them. When I'm cooking and I'm listening to a podcast, got them in there. When I'm cooking and a call comes on, it's they're just great they're just really really nice they just they're a luxury item of course but they are really a nice to have and i'm glad that i got them as a gift i really am glad that i got them as a gift because i feel like i'm, I'm using them more and i don't know i feel like it's a sense of i value this gift a lot more so four skincare items that i really really love and i have to mention first and foremost i talked about this in a I think it was a haul, like a clicks haul or something. I picked up the Eucerin Hyaluron Filler um, Eye. It's an eye cream. And I picked this up at clicks. I wanted something to reduce the wrinkles that I was, you know, that I had. And it, my eyes were just looking crazy. But also, also, um, I had an issue with dark circles around my eyes. And I needed my eyes to just sort of pop up look lighter look brighter also one of the reasons why i've been taking my uh gel eye drops and all of that i needed my eyes to kind of pop and the skin around my eyes to just look much better than it did and i can tell you can i tell you can i tell you this eye cream is really really good it's like a bang for your buck I'm trying to be very money conscious right now, extremely money conscious, because in the beginning of next year, I'm going to have to make some really difficult decisions again. So I'm trying to be very, very money, money, money conscious right now. And I picked this one up. Typically, I would pick up an eye cream from Kiehl's or um, I really like the one from Clinique, the Moisture Surge eye cream, the one in the small bottle pink really love that one as well but this time around i wanted something that will increase the volume in the you know just the skin around my eye reduce the wrinkles and lighten the dark skin and this has done the most if you want to see proof of that watch my recent vlogs and pay attention to the skin around my eyes and then try watching all the one and then pay attention to the skin around my eyes definitely been doing the most i've been using this for about Two months now give or take really really impressed with it so impressed um another item that i'm quite impressed with is this this is the nivea anti-age q10 multi-action ah uh, it's a lot uh nivea q10 power anti-age multi-action youth oil booster this is an oil that i apply on every single morning after i take a shower i don't use it at night I just don't no um i i love this i love this i take about two or three drops of this after i come out of the shower 
I will dry my face and all of that, do, do you know, cleanse, whatever, then dry my face. And then the first thing that I go in with is my moisturizer. Then I go in with the oil just to seal everything in. Ka -ka -ka. And then I top it off with an SPF. Really, really love this. Um, and it, it's just so good. My skin, my facial skin, skin on my face for winter has looked really, really good. And I've been so impressed. And I have to attribute it to um, the skincare that I am using. And I love the fact that this skincare is skincare that is easily accessible, that is not too crazy on the prices. I was gifted this, so I'm not quite sure how much it is but it's a really really great oil oh my gosh i love how my skin is looking right now and i have to mention that this is one of the project products projects project puja <laughs> one of the products that i've been using religiously really really love it definitely advise definitely recommend recommend um, another product that i repurchase over and over again wherever i can find it because it's one of my favorite products of all time this is the Laneige water sleeping mask my skin gets dry in winter and gets real thirsty and needs a lot of hydration and I feel like this is one of the best products this is probably my third my third yeah I think so my third container of the Laneige water sleeping mask but Luna yo it's just it's great it's great you can pick it up on best beauty buys you can pick it up on muse beauty you can pick it up on uh, uh samika www.samika.co.za they sell some Laneige products as well really 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 great mask that i use at night and after i do my skincare routine and all of that on some nights i'll do a cream i'll just apply a cream which i'm going to show you now on other nights i just feel like when i feel like my skin needs it like on a very cold night very cold night then i'll apply on the water sleeping mask because man my skin will drink this up and i love it i love it and definitely wanted to recommend so if I'm not using the water sleeping mask, I am using this Revitalift Energizing Red Cream. Again, another product that I was gifted and <laughs> it's good, man. It's really, really good. Very creamy, cream, very, uh, but also quite smooth when it goes onto your skin. I use this at night. I don't use it during the day. Um, but it's really, really great because it is from the Revitalift range. So it's great for anti-aging, anti-wrinkle, and um, really, really great for smooth, trying to smooth out, reducing wrinkles and reducing all of the, um, um, the signs of aging on your skin smooths things out quite nicely love it love it this is the good earth shea butter range and this is the body butter body butter body body lotion <laughs> this is the body lotion and this is the body butter now i use another brand i don't want to mention the name a quite well-known brand if you've been following me for a very long time you know which brand i love for body butters you know which one i love but let's not get into the name of the brand um but their body butters are quite pricey and as i said i am trying to um be more conservative with my spending so i am looking out for really great um, body care, skin care items and all of that, uh, beauty items, whatever, that are at a reasonable price. And I'm doing this deliberately. I can go expensive, but it's not going to make financial sense for me in the next couple of months, the beginning of the next year. So I am not trying to go crazy right now. I think found these gems. These things get gems alone. I found these gems at clicks and um, from the Good Earth range. Yo, my favorite one between the two, definitely the body lotion. This stuff sinks into your skin, makes you sweet, warm, supple, holdable, caresses your skin with just beautifulness and it's shea butter and shea butter is really good for your skin as well 
I love it. And the first ingredient of these two products are water, which is really, really nice for me to see because water is always good, is good, is good for your Buddha, okay, your body. So lastly, our hair products from Cantu. And this is the coconut curling cream. And the one I forgot upstairs is the, uh, but you'll see it on my Instagram page somewhere, is the tea tree and jojoba oil, hot water oil. And I apply that onto my hair. One thing about dyed hair, it's dry. It is dry. Okay, if you dye your hair, you know how dry your hair will get. So moisturizing and hydration is imperative. And I do this every day. Because my hair is dyed, I do not wash it every day. So I wash it like once a week. Um, uh, and it's short hair. So I'm not necessarily concerned about, oh my gosh, only once a week. Are you serious? No, I'm not concerned about that. But um, moisturizing it is a daily affair. Okay, I will wet it in the shower. I wet it every day. I wet it in the shower and then I come out and then I moisturize and I go in with the oil and I go in with the, um, I use another hair food, hair cream from Maui. And um, on days where I want to pop the curls, which is today, I don't know if you guys can see, but the curls are popped. Okay, <laughs> on a day that I want to pop the curls, I will then use this. The products smell amazing. The products are great. The products, I don't want to touch my hair. The products keep your hair soft and supple. Whew, but it's, yeah, so I am used to, you know, I know that dyeing your hair, it just really strips your hair uh, of moisture and hydration and you have to have to focus on those things. And for me, this, a definite win, a definite win. Okay. I hope you guys enjoyed this video quite long but definitely some of my favorite things i would highly 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 recommend that you purchase these things um and yeah i'm gonna go film another video right now and i will see you in the next video i hope you subscribed join the jk fam and i'll see you soon bye